Flutter 3 just came out and you may be interested in using it with Flame. So let's give it a shot. There is a warning here, which I did see before when I was using Flutter Flame, uh, Flutter 3.0 with Flame. But let's uh, maybe change the channel and we can see where we're at. So right now I'm running Flutter uh, 2.10.5 and it does work. It's using Dart 2.16. So with the previous version of Flutter, uh, Flame does work. This is a Flame desktop application. I'm going to stop it. I'll switch my Flutter channel over to stable. And it's going to convert over to Flutter 3. After it finishes the upgrade, let's check out Flame again and see where we're at. Alright, so now I'm using Dart 2.17 and Flutter 3.0. And try to repeat the command. Let's see where we're at. Alright, it is running and there is a bunch of these errors here which uh, is the same error that's mentioned on this. It says your build should be unaffected except for the reverse verbose warnings. You can ignore the warnings for now and so the dependent the error is in the uh, flame or the warnings in the flame code. Let's see whether it actually makes a difference or not. So assuming you've upgraded to uh, Flutter three, All right? So it's now in Flutter three with Dart two seventeen, and you try to create a flame project. Let's see what happens. So installed flame 1.1.1. 1. 1. 1. We'll bust out VS code. And the pubspec.yaml is now Dart 217, right? So I'm going to control dot to import the flame game. I'll substitute this for the widget. Okay, let's run it. Okay, the black screen does appear and there are these warnings uh, but it does seem to be working so let's see whether we can just ignore it and then go forward for now so I'll try with a sprite component I'll create assets images then I'll, in the pubspec.yaml, I'm going to add a sprite, so I need an image. So I had a flappy bird on my computer. Okay, I have the bird. And I think I'll call him bird.
We'll set up the onload method. Okay, test out the sprite. I usually use load sprite, but let's try out something a little different where we we load the image and we can load the sprite from the image. Okay, it looks like it's working, although we do have this warning. Let's just make sure the bird can move. Okay, the bird is moving. Let's make sure it can move around the screen. We'll set up a velocity and in the classic physics, the position of an object equals the velocity times the change in time, delta t. Oh, plus equals. Oh, and there the bird goes. He's flying along. So it looks like we're going to have this warning uh, until it's probably like flame 1.2 or 1.1.2. But we can use Flutter 3 and Dart 217. So I'm going to go ahead with the tutorials using the uh, flame 1.1.1 and Dart or Flutter uh, 3.0. The application appears to work fine. Oh, not clearing it. Ah. Not going to get all the gems.